New tonight, several police agencies and the TBI are on the scene of an officer involved shooting in Saudi Daisy. Thanks for watching. I'm Kim Chapman. And I'm Josh Rowe. Details are still limited at this hour. Alana LaFleur is on the scene right now. Alana, what can you tell us? Josh, Kim, the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office says at about 7 o'clock tonight, deputies shot a person and it is still very active in the 200 block of Sequoia Access Road. This is to show you how active it is. You can see there's lots of lights flashing. You can see there is a group of investigators and a mobile response unit near the Sequoia Crossing. I want to give you the background of what happened leading up to this officer involved shooting. Again, the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office told us that at about 5 o'clock, they started pursuing a person. We don't know why that person was being pursued. They won't tell us that detail yet, but that was going on for two hours until about seven o'clock when the shooting happened near the Sequoia Crossing. And we don't know the condition of the person who was shot, but as Josh said there, the TBI is here investigating along with several other agencies. The Hamilton County Sheriff's Office says this has been a very difficult night, and here's a little bit more of what they had to say about this shooting. We you know, ask the support and the prayers of the of the public for the you know for not only the person involved, the perpetrator, but also our deputies involved. It's just anytime you have to pull your weapon in a form of duty is it's always a tragic situation. Limited details at this time. We don't know why they were pursuing the person, but we are going to stay here to try to learn more. We're told someone from the TBI will be here along with their agents and forensic scientists. For now, reporting live in Saudi Daisy, Alana LaFleur, News Channel 9. Alana, thank you. We'll continue to follow this story and have updates on air and online as they become.